I'm Nicole Akong. I run a jewellery label called Akong London, based in London. Um, I started the label in January this year, so we've only been going for about eight months. How it worked for you the first days? Yeah, it's been great. I've met some really, really good people and the response to the work has been fantastic, so I'm really pleased. There I see a beautiful piece. Maybe you could tell us a bit about that sure. and show it to the... Sure. So this piece is the Feather Fringe Necklace and it's from the current collection. Um, it's very much a luxe feel. So these pieces incorporate lots of feathers, fur, very sumptuous trims. Each of my pieces has quite a few different components, which I think which makes it quite different. Lots of different materials that come together. Um, but mainly it's all about the silhouette fitting into the actual clothing. So I consider myself designing jewellery more for, for fashion. Like it, it's almost jewellery for clothing rather than jewellery in and of itself. My target lady is above all very confident. Uh, and when I say confidence, I mean fashion-wise. She's stylish, but she knows what she likes. She's a very assured fashion style. Um, and yeah, she just kind of likes w wearing something a bit different, standing out, um, and seeking things which are a bit individual and definitely unique. seeing crazy stuff here. Could you explain it? Well, this is my Spring Summer 2011 collection. He's a Superman. The collection is based on lots of complicated story. And um, to simplify it is one is my friend who is filmmaker and uh, his latest film called Mr. Francois. And uh, in that film, he's, you know, he's acting as Miss Clark. And uh, then later around the friendship grows. I know he used to be a Superman in the Superman campaign 1970s. Um, then, you know, while getting to know him, he's a very powerful guy. He thinks he can do everything. That's really inspiring for me. I feel like everybody has a Superman moment in their life. And uh, that was the way to Busan Fashion Week. And I went to the South Korea Toys Museum. They have an amazing Astro Boy, Superman, you know, all the characters you want in the world. And then they become a little object in my collection. But each piece has a story behind it, which is about this person, you know, who I really like, you know, how we encourage each other in our work, basically. Then, you know, you see Superman in friendship growing. So that's how it's based. <laughs> Time, throw your arms around me.